everybody. Um, it is the next day and I know the lighting is not great, so I'm sorry. But I have um, all of my bookshelves right here. Um, I'm going to kind of show you a layout of how I'm going to put everything. I have all but three or four of like the big like 31 inch bookshelves from um, Ikea. These are all like the 15 and a half inch and then they're like short 15 and a half inch ones. So I'm going to try to start putting these together but I'm going to show you around our bedroom and kind of show you where all this is going to go. Um, they were out of the regular size so we'll see how that goes into finding new ones because um, I, I cut my hand open today. It's not, it's nothing crazy, but I don't wanna like rip it open while I'm putting these together, but they didn't have any of the regular ones and it's like a two hour drive, two and a half, two hour and 15 minute drive from us to Ikea. So it's not like we can just run and pick them up when they're in stock, so. We'll see when we can go get those. For right now, I'm just going to use my two, um, my two Target and my Walmart shelf. Dang it, focus. For right now, I'm just going to use my two Target and my Walmart shelf, um, that I've currently been using. But, let me flip this around, show you what we're working with. So, this is our master bedroom. Um, there's kind of stuff everywhere right now, just kind of sitting, um, but there are going to be shelves all the way across here and then all the way on each side of the window. Um, so there's going to be a short shelf here, um, that way we can still reach the light and then we'll have like a tabletop to put like my pocketbook and stuff like that on. And then there will be three of the regular size large Billy Book cases from Ikea. So, for now, these will just sit here. We're going to mount our TV. Sorry, I'm watching Selling Tampa. Um, we are going to mount our TV, and then there is going to be the short Billy bookcases all the way under it. So, that'll create it like a tabletop above it, and we'll have the Billy bookcases there. There'll be three small Billy bookcases in this corner, and then I think one more here. And then one large one there and one small one there. So, when we're done with, oh my gosh, when we're done with it, I'm going to have basically like half of a library around here. And then my husband is also going to build me a bench seat under this window, which I am so excited about. It's a very large window. Um, it's both sides of this, so a very large window. But, but I'm really excited to get it done, and I'll be able to store more than just books on it. Um, I plan on getting some of the, some, like, baskets to sit on some of the shelves on, like, the bottom row. Um, to just store, like, paperwork and, like, kind of stuff in. So that, that kind of stuff just doesn't have to, like, sit in a box under our bed, which is where it's at right now. Um, and I'm excited to be able to, like, display my books really pretty. Um, so I'm really excited about this. But I'm going to time lapse you while I put a couple of these together. I might not do all of them um, just because I do film on my phone. And then what am I supposed to do? Just watch TV? No, I need like Instagram breaks and TikTok breaks. But um, let's go ahead and get started with putting together. I have one, two, three, four, five tall, skinny ones. And then this band aid's coming off. I have five tall skinny ones and five short skinny ones. So, ten bookshelves to put together. This is definitely not all going to get done tonight. Um, we also bought, I know y'all saw, we bought a lot. Um, we bought some new things for my kids' playroom. I bought another Alex store for my office. And we also got six of the tall Billy bookcases plus, plus the extension height extenders for our movie room, which is not a movie room yet. It's eventually going to be a movie room, but for our movie room area where all of my Funko Pops are. 
So, um, I guess I will give you a Funko Pop tour for those of you who that have asked for it. After we, I might show like the reorganization stuff once we like go and get the big bookcases in there. Um, but I'm not gonna like document the whole process like I am with this. I'm excited. I'm gonna get started on putting these together. I'm hoping to have this done by like middle of this week so that I can reorganize my stuff and feel good about it because right now I've kind of just got like my shelves are very full and then I've just got like books just kind of sitting and like this down here this is a disaster um and also I bought the um We got the adventure challenge. So we might have to do a vlog of doing one of those one day, um, which will be fun. So I'm gonna get you set up on the tripod so that I can speed through me putting a couple of these together. And I'll check back in after, maybe I do two. short runs together so I think I'm going to put this last one together and then I'm going to put it here shift these put the four like under the TV and set the TV up and be done for the night because it is like 12 30 and I want to read it a little before I go to sleep and this bandage is driving me nuts on the fact that it won't stay on my hand I'm really happy with how easy these are to put together compared to like these three like these three were a pain to put together but these billy ones are really easy because like the entire side is one piece and like the tall ones are the same way and like where these are like two pieces um so it's a lot more pieces to try to put together but we are going to Put this last one together. Get my husband to come up here and help me get the TV down and move this dresser. I'm just going to move it to this wall for right now. This wall. I'm pointing into the camera like you're going to be able to tell them. It's going to sit between our closet and bathroom. Um, and I think I'm eventually going to put it in the closet for right now. Um, we're eventually going to redo our closet. But that'll probably be a next year project because... I really want the pack system and it is expensive. Here we go.
Okay, so we hit a slight hiccup. Um, we planned on just sitting the TV on top of the short shelves, but the TV stand is, oh, this freaking band-aid. The TV stand is too wide to be able to do that. So, um, for right now, we have this going on. Um, I'll show you a better view of that in a second. But, for right now, we've kind of just done this for tonight. We're going to mount the TV um, where it should go tomorrow. Like, we'll measure out from the small one. It's a freaking band-aid, I swear to God. I can't, like, take it off and sleep without it because, Lord forbid, I'll have to get Lane to get me another one. Lord forbid I bleed on my white sheets. I might lose my mind. But, so we're going to measure out from the one in the corner that is in the place that it will be. How much space the three are going to take up. Figure out where the TV needs to be mounted. And then we'll just kind of go from there and hope to God our measuring is right. <laughs> when we get, when we get the big ones. So. Yay, math. I'm so good at it. Um, so I'm gonna flip the camera around, show you what we have working on tonight. I just, my books are just everywhere. Um, I just, cause I had to slide all three of those shelves, so I had to take all the books off of them. And then, so everything's a mess right now. And I'm gonna watch the rest of this episode of Love is Blind. And then I'm going to, read a little bit of the rebel and go to bed and then i will pick back up with you tomorrow so right now we have our little one right here that is going to stay here and then it's going to be three big ones from ikea which is going to be a lot wider than this it'll actually scoot the tv i think it'll it'll scoot the tv this way just a hair um but so there'll be three big ones here and then these four will just go under the tv for right now, they're just on each side of the dresser for tonight until we can get together what we need to get together <laughs> and mount the TV. Um, we already have the mount, so it shouldn't be that hard. It won't take that much time, but I'm really excited with how it's looking already. I think it's going to be so nice. And the plan is to, once we get all the big ones in, to make them look built in. So we'll like... There'll be a little bit of space between them and we'll run um, boards to like um, hide the seam and we'll run a board across the bottom of all of them and the top of all of them to close it all in and make it all um, cohesive. I, I didn't buy the shelf extensions for the tall ones because I wasn't sure if we're going to have to build a platform underneath of all of them for them to sit on. So we're just going to have to play that by ear by like when we get the big ones. So if we can fit the shelf extensions, we'll do that. If not, we'll do the um, brain work, please. If we, if we do, if we can't do the shelf extensions when we do the base, We'll just do a shelf that'll run along the entire top which might be kind of cool because I could run it above my window I don't know that I mentioned yes I mentioned that I'm getting a window a window seat that Lane's building me so I'm really excited I'm really really excited I'm really 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 excited about my window seat but running books across the top of the window might actually be kind of cool so we'll see how that pans out um, I'll see you tomorrow whenever, it'll probably be tomorrow night before I can pick up and start working on this again, because tomorrow's going to be very busy. Um, but I will see you tomorrow. It is currently 12 o'clock at night. Um, my bed's not even made. I didn't even do that today. But progress has been made. I got my corner shelf together. The tea has been hung. Uh, I I'm so excited. So, I think I have one more that I'm going to put together. Probably not tonight. 
but my room is a freaking mess from where we've been moving stuff around. But I'm going to give you an overview of, I've got all the shelves and the ones under the TV. And um, it's kind of hard to tell right now like what very end product is going to look like. But for right now, I'm very happy with it. So let me show you. Like I said, it's a mess. But we have my little one, my three big ones for right now. I'm going to put another one of those here. For right now and then we have my four short ones under the tv so these will stay where they are and then i have my three corner ones um this was a little bigger than we thought it was gonna be so i'm not gonna have room to put another one here which is fine um my window seat will just come out a little bit farther but once we actually get my other like my billy my top my wide billy ones everything is going to be like spread out a little bit and then we're going to come in with like molding and close it off but i'm going in and putting all the shelves i gotta put all the shelves on this one um so that i can start organizing these and then i've just got to put this other one together for here and then the other one is just going to go over there for right now like i said it's a mess my books are everywhere but we are getting somewhere Hello. Um, I got my hair done today, so we're very ashy. We're a lot shorter. We're very layered. Um, it's not styled, but I really love it. So, as you know, we got all of our shelves together. I think I showed these to y'all last night. Did I show y'all these last night? I'm pretty sure I did. So, I have all my shelves. I've started organizing these over here. Um, I love this idea so i'll have my bully one um and then i have my brittle prints down there i love the way these look right now absolutely love it i love the way my lounge fly bags look in this corner they look so good but um i'm going to try to um just spread out my bookshelves get all of this organized I actually might put this last um shelf together so that so that that is completely done um so I will do that I will come back once I get that done
frustrated with not knowing how to organize these three. Um, I'm not really sure. I'm not real sure what I want to do. So, for... I think for tonight, I'm going to stop and reevaluate when my brain's clear. Because right now, I don't know what I want to do. But I do know that. Thank you, Abby. So, this, these are pretty much done. Let me flip you around so I can show you. Okay, so this shelf is pretty much done. It's going to move just a little bit. So, here's what's going to happen is this is going to be a Sophie Lark shelf eventually. So, I have the Air, the Rebel, and then I'm going to have both of my copies of the Bully, both of my copies of the Spy, and then both of my copies of Savage once those come out. Um, and then I'm going to have all of my other Sophie Lark books are going to sit here. So, this Coho shelf... It's going to move here, and then this whole thing is going to shift down, and then my book of the month's one will go somewhere else for now. But I absolutely love this one as it is right now. Um, I'm really liking this as well. I really need to center my Twilight books or get something to go on the other side. Um... I'm okay with this one. I'm going to go ahead and get the next book in this because I want to start reading that and try to finish that up. Um, I have um, Kingdom of the Wicked on the way. So this is kind of like duets right now. Um, and then I really, I really like this and this. And then this is my Jasmine Glory shelf. Um, but this is what I have left to figure out where to put. So, um, I might not be able to space some of this out as much as others just to be able to fit it all. Um, but I think I have most of, like, my favorite stuff displayed. See how this ends up. Um, I'm so much stressed about it because I don't enjoy having like second guessing myself when I'm organizing things like this a lot of times my brother helps me because he can like he can make things what I see in my head he can help me make visually like here he's really good at that so he'll be home tomorrow night he'll probably get him to help me tomorrow so we'll see you on Thursday when we continue this. Hello and happy Thursday. I am done. There are no books in my floor. This is just going to have to work for right now. Um, so I'm going to give you a quick overview of what this looks like for right now. And then I'm going to, in like a week or two, upload a complete um, bookshelf tour. So, um, I'll give you this quick overview of what my shelves look like for right now. Um, I'm really happy with them for the most part. There's, it's just like these three. These three, I'm not feeling right now. But, here's an overview. <laughs>
Billy bookshelves. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below what kind of organization you use for your books. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!